so what is our target we are going to access internet from private instance with the help of NAT gateway or NAT instance so NAT gateway NAT instance we have to create here in public site public one or public two not an issue anywhere either NAT gateway or NAT instance NAT gateway that is a AWS managed service NAT instance nothing but a instance with NAT configured in NAT instance limited bandwidth is there and it is 24 by 7 but NAT instance depends on the instant capacity you can utilize more bandwidth and you can stop this instance or as per your requirement you can generate and you can delete it so let's continue this same portion and then NAT gateway and NAT instance purpose internet access from private instance fine okay <coughs> so let's start connect to AWS site home page that is management console and we have to create VPC simple way VPC gateway subnet routing let's create same as yesterday class VPC 192 and CIDR 192 0.0 slash 24 create VPC VPC is created now internet gateway create and attach create internet gateway IGW 192 <coughs> that's all and attach it to my VPC 192 let's attach it complete now let's create subnet same as yesterday class I'm going to create four subnet to public to private under my own VPC VPC 192 so first subnet public one average zone A and CID range of this subnet 192 0.0 slash 28 <coughs> next subnet subnet name public to availability zone AP South 1B and CIDR 192 168 0.16 slash 28 third subnet that is my private subnet third subnet private one availability zone A CIDR 192 168 0.32 slash 28 and fourth one private two zone B A B anyone you can choose 192 168 0 dot 48 28 if you forget this CIDR calculation again please check the networking recap that class okay recap it CIDR portion I 
and it is over so let's create four subnet create it now root table one for public one for private so first one is public root under which vpc 192 and create another routing table private now private private route we have to select the VPC 192 so two root table is created one public one private now we have to add the subnet that is associate subnet so public root subnet associates I have to add public 1 and public 2 and in roots that is we have to attach to gateway so you have to mention 0000, zero, zero, zero that is any destination that should be through internet gateway this is my gateway and what about private root private root we have to associate the subnet which subnet private 1 and private 2 okay and there was no root because if you check this private 2 subnet is associate to private routing and it is not going to connect to gateway or any other okay up to this is over now I am going to create one PC in public side one PC in private side then connection now internet access from public it is available possible but it is not possible from private PC then we have to solve it using NAT NAT instance NAT gateway two different options are there so let's continue this PC and then check it now we have to create one instance in public site one instance in private site so let's create instance launch instance this is public PC operating system is Linux 2 T2 key pair let me check key is there or not if already key is there we are ju just going to use same key yes private PC key public PC key it is there so we are going to use some existing key I'm not going to create this is public machine so public PC key okay regarding network first option is our VPC should be own VPC not default so VPC 192 subnet it should be public one and public IP should be enabled regarding security group I'm creating pub security group pub security group and regarding rules there is a firewall rules SSH from my IP let's launch the instance so one instance one public instance is launched now I'm going to create another instance in private private site launch instance name private PC key 
की पेयर प्राइवेट पीसी की रिगार्डिंग नेटवर्क वी हैव टू चूज आवर वीपीसी वीपीसी 192 सबनेट शुड बी प्राइवेट ऑटोमेटिकली इट विल एक्सेप्ट प्राइवेट वन एंड पब्लिक आईपी शुड बी डिजेबल बिकॉज इट इज प्राइवेट इंस्टेंस देन रिगार्डिंग सिक्योरिटी ग्रुप प्राइवेट सिक्योरिटी ग्रुप डिस्क्रिप्शन प्राइवेट सिक्योरिटी ग्रुप एस एस एच कनेक्शन आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू डिस्टर्ब एनीथिंग बट वी हैव टू चेंज आफ्टर क्रिएशन ऑफ द इंस्टेंस वी हैव टू चेंज बिकॉज माई प्राइवेट इंस्टेंस इज गोइंग टू कनेक्ट वाया एस एस एच फ्रॉम फ्रॉम विच मशीन फ्रॉम माई पब्लिक मशीन सो यू हैव टू सेट हेयर दैट पब्लिक मशीन प्राइवेट आई पी फ्रॉम दैट आई पी ओनली वी आर गोइंग टू कनेक्ट इट सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू इट देन आई एम गोइंग टू चेंज बिकॉज राइट नाउ आई डोंट नो द आई पी एड्रेस ऑफ माई पब्लिक मशीन सो लेट सी दिस इज माई प्राइवेट पी सी दिस इज माई पब्लिक पी सी सो माई पब्लिक पी सी प्राइवेट आई पी एड्रेस इज वन नाइनटी टू वन is 0.45 so in private pc security group we have to mention if anyone is going to connect this ip that is this private machine no public ip ha huh? this 0.48 then it is possible only from only from which machine private ip of public instance that is 192.168.0.10 slash 32 <coughs> slash 32 means only this ip save so back to instance and let's check it private machine IP address is 10. I mentioned properly, and private one, 45. Now let's connect my public PC and try to connect my private PC. But for that purpose, first we have to use P agent. I just remove this key and add my private PC key. and close now copy the ip address start putty is it to hyphen user at ip address ssh auth public public pc key and allow agent forwarding open connected if i check sudo yum install httpd what happen it is possible i am not going to install now let's connect ssh 192.168.0.45 Y E S. It is connected. And forty five. Here it is showing zero dot forty five. Connected from zero dot ten. So, it is connected. Right. Now, let's check. Sudo yum install httpd. It is. possible or not possible no not possible yes it is trying amazon linux there is that but it is not possible because there was no gateway it is not attached mm -hmm. okay so control z cancel it we have to provide nat gateway no sir? right right nat gateway or nat instance mm -hmm. so now i am going to create either 
you assume anything NAT gateway or NAT instance here. I just write here it is NAT. Now gateway or gateway or instance. After that once we create it we have to attach it from this private. That's all. Okay. So first I am going to check NAT gateway because it is managed service easy to creation. NAT instance it is a special type of instance where NAT already configured but if there are any issues in configuration then it is not going to work. Okay. So we have to use either own our own instance configuration and then we can utilize our own instance. Create image when it is required we can create instance again delete it. Or from marketplace from community we can create it okay but in community uh, each and every server is not okay so let's see how to create it now I am going to create NAT gateway so NAT gateway purpose back to VPC oh. in this VPC this is NAT gateway let's create create NAT gateway. My NAT gateway name is NAT hyphen gateway hyphen 192 and where it is going to create in priv uh, public 1 or public 2? Public 2. Public site. Public 1 to anyone. Publicly elastic IP we have to provide one elastic IP right now we have no elastic IP so just allocate elastic IP it is going to create and allocate here so don't forget to delete this elastic IP when you delete it create NAT gateway so NAT gateway is created back and check it it is under construction showing pending once it is going to show available then we have to attach it to private private routing here once it is ready you have to attach it and then we will check it again so right now it is in pending state it may take one two minutes let it be available then delete purpose this one at the end I will show you delete option so once it is available I am going to attach to routing table private routing table same way public routing table I attach gateway here it is NAT gateway internet gateway NAT gateway that's all so still pending let it be available
now it is available once it is available I have to attach it in routing table private routing table routes edit routes add routes 0 0 0 that is any where NAND gateway this time NAND gateway save ok now what is my target I want to check what is the status it is time over duplicate now just try to connect SSH 192.168.0.45 and sudo yum install httpd PID is running. Or kill minus nine. PID is two three seven one. Then again try. Okay. Should do. And then try it now it is possible but I'm not going to install okay it is from 45 45 means my private site fine now how to create instance okay just two minutes Okay, let's check it. How to create instance? NAT instance. NAT gateway is over. Now NAT instance purpose. Launch instance. Say my instance name is NAT. Which OS? Uh, this is the important location. Browse more AMI. Because these are all normal instance. NAT is not configured. So browse more and click on community and then search NAT so it is going to show all the NAT instance okay these are community edition you can utilize this one also but this is not okay this instance is not okay so you can create any other instance these are all NAT is in uh, already configured AWS this is NAT Java something but you cannot use this one you have to first take a op that is one option is there you have to verify it Debian is possible AWS Amazon Linux to HBM NAT Java something is there let's see first one is not okay I already checked it so I choose this one and then T2 micro 
key pair same as public site public pc key network we have to choose our vpc 192 and nat should be in public site right don't forget it it should be in public site public to and ip should be enabled public ip regarding security group i just create a new security group nat security group and description nat security group this rules firewall rules later i am going to uh, select it or modify it now it is let it be saved just create the instance once instance is ready check it this is nat now it is not ready once it is okay we have to follow this options where it is yes nat create nat instance security group nat instance we have to add all traffic from this and then nat instance we have to stop it is not a source not a destination normally any instance either it is a source or destination suppose your computer your laptop desktop whatever that is source when you are accessing google google is the destination but nat also instance but it is not a source not a destination it is in between private instance that is the source and internet that is the target in between private instance and target nat is there so nat not a source not a target and then we have to add this we have to add this security group that is any packet it must move to nat instance so first option is over our instance is ready let's continue the security group so nat instance is running nat instance security group nat instance security group. edit only ssh is there i am going to add all traffic Uh, we have to use custom and we have to set here 192.168.0.32 slash 28 this is my private one subnet you can add one more private second subnet okay now I have one instance only in this subnet so I just add this one save it So second one is over now net instance purpose disable this source destination how it is action network change so instance nat action networking change source destination check and stop it over as per the documentation last one is this routing table private routing table this is my private routing table routes edit last time I add this is NAT gateway delete it and then add any where it is instance which instance NAT instance save and move to this machine this is dot 10 so we are going to connect SSH 192 168 0.45 connected now sudo yum install httpd if it is okay means your instance is okay it is asking right if i use yes it is going to install i'm pressing n 
sometimes it is not going to work if your instance is not okay okay so first instance in community first instance is not working that is already I tested but this instance is working so this is the way NAT instance or NAT gateway please go through up to this okay and then we have to delete one by one I'm stopping my video Close till I get up Time is barely on our side